Here we go. You ready? Ready. He's ready. Uh... Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Burping Contest. We are back to the actual contest format. It's been a long time coming, truly a long time coming. The first Burping Contest video was done in September of 19, and we are now August of 21, and we got the Dan, we got the Gert. We are currently headed up to Minneapolis, Minnesota for the Minnesota Vikings preseason game against the Indianapolis Colts. It's gonna be our first real game experience together at the US Bank Stadium. We're super stoked. And of course, we figured, why not film a burping contest video on our way up? We have literally like a three hour drive ahead of us. So might as well open up some Burpicola and see what kind of belches we can come up with today. So without further ado, we're gonna to introduce today's Burpicola and my choice was a a and W zero sugar root beer. I'm a zero sugar guy. That's just how it is. I've never drank A and W zero sugar on bourbon contest before. I've had zero sugar IBC root beer, but never A and W. Yurt, what, uh, what I, did you uh, choose? I chose the Coca Cola Zero Cherry Vanilla. Woo! I might get some of them little frothy burps, you know, <laughs> maybe. Because Coke does create that like foaminess in your throat, so you never know what to expect. So, here we go. Let's crack these bad boys open. Cheers, my friend. Because as you all know, we open it fresh on camera to make sure that you guys are getting the truest experience. Let's dive in. Ooh, that's a strong burn. Right off the bat. Right off the bat, baby. We're doing this on empty stomachs. Yes. Because I learned during my three week burping contest videos that doing it on a full stomach is no bueno. Side note, I've had a nose whistle for the past, the past three months straight. I can't get rid of it. And so if at any point during today's video, you just hear this really high pitch dog whine, yeah. it's just my nose. It's not our brakes going out. Nope, our brakes are good. No. We don't have a dog being kept in the trunk. No. It's not a child being kidnapped. No. It's my sinuses. How does it taste? Does it taste good? Yeah, it's super good. Dang, Gertz almost halfway done with his. I gotta chug some more. <laughs> I let him come naturally. I don't yes. force anything. Of course, of course. So I will say, kids, that this is like the first sit-down format video that that I've done with Gert. Gert's been on the channel, obviously, a handful of times. State Fair and uh, Searching for Sasquatch, things like that. But we've never had a sit-down format. And I, I'm sure I've discussed to a degree just how far Gert and I go back. But outside of a few people that I know from church as a kid. Gert's my longest friend. This year is literally our 20th year anniversary of being friends. 20 years ago is when I first enrolled into public school because I was homeschooled for eight years. And then brother Seth and I open enrolled in the school where, where Gert was going. The very first me like main memory I have when I started going to school there was when Gert and I were in PE together and we were playing volleyball. And this mother sucker over here goes to hit hit the volleyball. I can recreate this. And he comes over writhing in pain and this is what he shows me. So I go up and smack the ball and then I'm like ow, ow, and I show him like, ah, I broke my finger. <laughs> and he, he's like just ghost faced. Like, oh, no way. Shock. Yeah, no way. It's great. And, I can bend my finger. Definitely. Yeah, his fingers are nuts. I literally went home that day and told my dad, dude, I was playing with my classmate in PE today, playing volleyball, and he went and like spiked the ball and just destroyed his finger. And my dad felt so bad for Gert, he didn't even know who Gert was, but felt so bad for him. 
And then I find out probably like a month later. Yeah, that was fake. Yeah, I thought I told you right away. I must not have. Nope, you didn't. You must have just been in shock that whole time. Yeah, and if you did tell me, I just didn't even hear you. Because I totally went home and told Dad. I was like, dude, this is this is crazy. Oh, I thought you were going. Yeah, you do on, the burp dance, baby. You got to do that burp dance. We got a, a van full of uh, family over here. And they were just looking at us as we're filming. That's the wonders of filming on the road. People see a GoPro and they're like, what? What are they doing in that view? Oh, man. Oh, that was a hard swallow. This is so... <coughs> so, so... <coughs> so, so... So, so... <coughs> foamy. It should be, it should be working. <laughs> Might be the first burp contest for us. <laughs> Not the first one that have one burp. Come on, come on. Not a single one. Just like start shaking your belly. Oh, I almost had one. I swallowed. Brought it back down. <laughs> Solid. chop on the diaphragm in the hot sweats it's worth it because Gert can belch on these Iowa roads and they're good tax money no potholes yeah I know I'm like yeah maybe the road will kind of mix things up a little bit it's like the smoothest road Yeah. Like I don't you ever have to deal with pea shyness? 
Like that's no. a real thing that I deal with. Not if I really have to be. If yeah. I really have to be, I'll let her go. But yeah. if I don't and I have to force myself to be, I will. It's not gonna happen. Uh, no. It's like not today. Yeah. Raj is over my no, I'm sorry, your dad's name's Raj. Cut that out. <laughs> 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 not Raj looking over Herb over here is looking over my shoulder and I just feel real, real insecure about it. And I get pee shy. Sorry to any Herbert that doesn't do that. But like, yeah. Herbert's really it's good. not that he is looking, okay. it's just the insecurity is telling you that he is. <coughs> this is a no fusion 17 cent. <laughs> Uh, energy drinker is getting open right now for his second Burpa Cola. Tiny and I found at our local hy V for 17 cents a can. We got 24 cans for less than five bucks. Unbelievable. So we switch it up from the cola to the energy drink. Oh, of course I'm talking. Energy drink, energy drink, energy drink. Energy drink. Dang it. That was it. That was it. <laughs> Okay, you were pre-gaming. You were pre-gaming for your uh, your energy drink. Those have pretty sharp carbonation. Those are good. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Can't be it. Flashbacks to 2009, no, 2008, 
we were, it was the night before, or the, like the, the last weekend of Christmas break, and we went out to eat, Gert, Seth, and I, at, at Perkins, <laughs> to celebrate yes. like a last few nights of full freedom. Yeah. And we ordered so much food, and we ate it all, and then we ordered massive milkshakes, and Gert ate more than everybody. <laughs> And he was so miserable on our drive. <laughs> yeah, I was like, my stomach was physically like enlarged. His bulbous tummy. Yeah, I was just. Before I got in the car, I was just standing there like, just a cold sweat. Like, I can't like bend my waist to like, get in the car. Like, I, I'm gonna be sick. We're driving home, and all of a sudden, Seth, Seth, pull over. <laughs> what? Seth, pull oh. over. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> yup. <laughs> open the open the back door and just. <laughs> <laughs> it's about twenty dollars worth of Perkins. Just oh slathered on the, on the pavement. <laughs> Luckily, there's no traffic. Oh my gosh! Oh. Literally stopped right in the middle of a busy road. Luckily there was nobody. It just he just puked everywhere. And then he by the I time felt amazing. Oh yeah. Afterwards. And oh. he's like, I'm ready to eat again. Yeah. It was honestly it was it, was, it felt phenomenal. It was you were like awful, like feeling like terrible. As soon as you get all the release. And yep. It's just off. Oh I'm man, all right, it was really, really good. Ooh boy, it's been a while since I've laughed like that. So we first met in eighth grade. That's when I opened and enrolled in public school. I was an eighth grader. So 20 years ago, I was in eighth grade. And then we ended up going to the same schools after, or the same colleges, and lived together through that. Went to Iowa Central Community, and then straight to you and I after that. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Whoa! We're getting there. See, just a yeah, little pregame. Yeah, it was the yeah, 20 ounce pregame, and now we're we're rolling. They're sneaky. They are sneaky. Up, 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 up. All right, my uh, number one is done. 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 Woo! Here we go. All right, I just got another die up here, so we're gonna crack that mess. That mess. That mess. Okay, we're off to the races now. Sure is good though. So foamy. You're gonna be buzzing off that energy drink too. Yeah. <laughs> Chugging 300 millis. I'm feeling a little logged up myself. Yeah. Oh, there it was. Scott. Yeah. And I was already friends with him. And you were friends. 
friends with them, so like it just kind of happened. Yeah. But yeah, it's been a. I think the thing that really set it off was that that weekend we stayed in uh, Palmer. Yep. Yep. Next neighbor's house. Yep, which would be the exact weekend where I saw my very first yep. ghost, where the opening scene of Haunted Iowa was filmed. Like that was like a catalyst, the jumping yep. catalyst for us. And then it was just like starting to dive into like the creepy stuff together. We found out we love horror movies together and video games and all that stuff. And and like Corey Scott and us, we're still really good friends. We don't see each other ever, but we still connect over Facebook. So it's been uh, been 20 years of fun, that's for sure. <laughs> on this perfect content. We got knife hands. up to enjoy a football game okay this man gave it his all he chugged 20 ounces of coke zero 16 ounces of an energy drink and now he's chugging a bunch of water thank god there's a rest stop that's coming up it's always fun to sit down with dan catch up a little bit and 
introduce him more to the audience. We're gonna go ahead and call it here. But as always, thank you for joining us here on Burping Contest. Down below, let us know who won, who gave the best burps, which burps were your favorite, time code it. I love when people time code their favorite burps. That's awesome. And as always, stay here on It's All Me for more burping contest videos and all the other video content that we do, because I'm not just a burper, I'm a video creator. We thank you for joining us here. Gert, any last words? Uh, it's all me and no fun. And we will see you in the next one.